Javier, thank you for joining us. It was notable that, that you had top billing. You were the first speaker after Sundar today to announce these changes to workspace. What do investors need to know about why it was such a priority and, and what the changes are? Well, look, I, uh, uh, first of all, I'm, I'm, I'm flattered that I, was, uh, I had the opportunity to, to follow Sundar at such an important conference. This is a, high, a hallmark for our, our year at Google. And I think, look, the, the, the most important part to get from this, I guess, is the, the fact that there's a lot of interest in the return to office and the, the future of collaboration as we evolve into what's next, uh, you know, in terms of how do we communicate and collaborate at work and in other facets of our lives. It's super, super important for Google to continue to lead the way there. And it also, in a way, uh, reflects our own priorities. We're a very large company that has innovated in, the, in its own practices, and Google Workspace plays a critical part in making Google do you know, the, the kind of innovative work that it does across so many areas. So it, I, I guess it's a reflection of uh, the importance of this space in general for the world and for the company. So what does that mean as far as your enterprise cloud business, right? Which is what, what the target is, which has grown tremendously and, and how you envision companies going back to work and using this product. Well, sure, look, uh, we've for the longest time been very active in helping drive the digital transformation and the transformation of the workplace. Even before the pandemic, you know, most companies, uh, you know, millions of companies around the world have chosen Google Workspace to drive a different approach to communication and collaboration amongst their employees, reaching all the way out to like their frontline workers and people that are normally not included in the discussion about, you know, your typical collaboration and the the things that happen inside of the office. And so, you know, the importance of this as an emerging uh, topic for industries around the world uh, uh, and the growth that it represents to Google and Google Cloud is uh, obviously part of our business. But again, it's also important to realize that these same products and part of what we announced today is that we're actually providing these products to everyone, right? So there's, uh, you know, Google Workspace overall has over 3 billion users and that's an important uh, uh, a component to this is these are products that are familiar, used by people in their everyday lives, and they have an important transformative role to play inside of the workspace. In particular, as we look to companies now coming back into the office in different ways and in different approaches around the world. So, so uh, talk to us about what was unique and new today. I believe smart chips and smart canvas were, were parts of it. What exactly are those, those aspects? Sure. So, you know, we, Google pioneered this idea that uh, digital documents aren't just like digital pieces of paper, right? All the way back to 15 years ago now, we introduced Google Docs as an inherently collaborative, real-time editing surface powered by the web. And that transformation has been so deeply ingrained, I guess, in people's minds that now, you know, a lot of people, uh, uh, you know, take that almost for granted. Uh, uh, Students and people entering the workforce nowadays know nothing other than the model that Google Docs actually got started 15 years ago. And so today what we announced represents another big step in not just taking the real-time collaboration part of Google Docs to a new level, but also in a way connecting documents further towards the people, tasks, and other content that they apply to, and therefore creating ultimately what wind up being much richer, more interactive documents. In a way, you can think of it this way, right? Typically, you have people uh, building documents about a plan, and so they gather together, they either build a document or a presentation, even a spreadsheet, and it's meant to represent people's ideas about what they want to do. But when it comes to the actual execution of the plan, that document tends to be just sort of a marker of reference. With Smart Canvas, we're actually bringing those two things closer together so that because of all the interactivity that people can deploy with Smart Chips, as you mentioned, you're able to have these kind of longer uh, living, breathing documents that are actually more connected to the people and the processes that they're driving. The other thing we announced today were a set of enhancements to Google Meet aimed at really facilitating a more effective and inclusive approach to uh, uh, retur return to office and remote and in office collaboration. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.